Spider-Man fans finally, finally got rewarded with the update they've been waiting for after being extremely patient and respectful. What to do, do right nation? I'm back with Super News Bits, bringing you the latest superhero news in less than three minutes because I respect your time if you subscribe. So if you want to be kept up to date with the latest games from Marvel and DC, hit the like button so it will reach more people. But if it wasn't for you, change it to a dislike. As most of you know, Insomniac, after a little over a month since they announced the delay, dropped this bomb on social media the day after the second Sony State of Play, finally giving Spider-Man 2 fans who have been starving for content since October due to there being absolutely no other games in the world to play. The release date of their next update. The highly anticipated DLC will be coming with many fan requested features, which so far have been confirmed to be New Game Plus, Mission Replay, changing the color of the symbiote tendrils from the anti-venom white to black, and the ability to alter the time of day. All of this will be coming to the game for free on March 7th, with a longer list of features to be released on social media closer to launch. The other thing they confirmed will be coming with the DLC is new suits, which which is great news. However, it should be noted that at least four of those suits will almost definitely be the previously revealed outfits as part of the collaboration with fashion designer Kid Super. Fans so far have reacted to those suits about as well as they did to Uncle Aaron's beats. However, there is hope they will include additional fan requested suits such as the cosmic spider-man from the comics or some of the suits from across the spider-verse like miguel's 2099 and the miles prowler outfit more spider-verse suits actually makes a lot of sense since insomniac just wrapped up a two-part video for sony where members of insomniac sat down with members of the spider-verse movie crew to discuss what it was like to work together for the cameos in the movie and the spider-verse side content in the main game that unlocks a secret cutscene after you get all the spider bots more features fans are hoping to show up include the ability to change the weather replay enemy bases and free roam as venom this was actually a glitch originally that was patched however making that glitch a real feature or at the very least adding a venom skin for peter i think would be a really cool idea for the players who are also hoping to play more as venom in a potential spin-off game which based on how the main game ended would certainly have to star a new host such as eddie brock or flash thompson this isn't the only spider Spider-Man 2 update expected to drop this year, and thanks to some inside information, we know there are some huge reveals coming soon. I'll break that down in the next video on screen.